Greetings, humanoids of the internet. My name is Bob, and this is episode number 156 of Journey into Space. Journey into Space. Uh, now, as it turns out, um, our uh, interplanetary rocket ship has a, a couple of major malfunctions. Uh, the first major malfunction is it has no SAS. Uh, I had totally apparently forgotten to put any SAS on it. Uh, the second major malfunction is they can't get out of the hatch. The hatches are obstructed. I did not test that before taking off for space. Uh, so uh, what I'm going to have to do is do something that uh, this uh, device was never designed for. It was never designed to land on a, a planet with a significant atmosphere. And that's exactly what I'm going to have to do. Okay, there's not particularly any good reason why this should survive re-entry. Uh, I do have a lot of radiators on it, and the radiators uh, I have found are surprisingly effective at um, uh, dissipating even uh, re-entry heat. Oh, we need to turn on these engines. Okay, again, no particularly good reason why this should survive re-entry. Um, I don't want to mess with having to send a guy up there to dock and uh, and uh, save these guys. Um, and not to mention this thing is a bulky ship. It's made even more so by the fact that it doesn't have any SAS. So this thing does have uh, parachutes. It has drogue chutes and regular chutes. Uh, if it can survive re-entry, it probably kind of should survive. Uh, yeah, that's... Uh, that's something that may or may not happen. Also, I have these tiny little heat shields uh, in there on the the the, um, the landing leg support, so which I put there uh, to deal with uh, uh, air breaking heat. But uh, how they'll survive on this thing, I have no idea. We're about to about to find out. All right, we're getting reentry heating. Uh, that docking port uh, has a good chance of going. So far, the radiators are doing their job. Oh, no, nope, radiators. Oh, uh, no, that docking port is starting to heat up. Uh, this could be a disaster. Poor Joe Wynn is right in that one, and then uh, got the other two right behind him. And there's really no way I can affect the cooling of that at all. Just gotta pray that they make it. Uh, docking parts par, par, ports about to blow blow oh we got we got problems we got heating docking ports about to go
Come on, come on. Make it through. I can't, can't even fire off the drogues yet. There's nothing I can do. Come on. Get through. Get through. Well, you're at 21,000 meters. You should be able to start, start cooling off now. Oh, that docking port's real close to blowing. Oh, and that's cooling down. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, whew. Oh, out of danger. Or at least out of danger of burning up the atmosphere. Drogue shoots off. Okay, 14 minutes a second. That should be survivable. Whew. Oh man, that was almost a disaster. I almost didn't put those parachutes on, but I put them on just in case, you know, I air breaked that Duna too close and wound up uh, landing on the planet. All right, Valentina Clawberry and Joe Joe win. This thing's gonna need a redesign. Okay, waiting. Whew. Valentina, Cloudberry, and Joe win. Well, you're going to be um, interplanetary ex explorer, but uh, perhaps on another occasion. Um, while I'm rethinking my, um, uh, my interplanetary spaceship design, uh, which I clearly need to do, um, uh, I'm going to do a little uh, little side trip. I'm going to to, uh, to send some vacationers to Minmus. Uh, in any case, who uh, oh, man, that was close. That's all for right now. Till next time, hasta la vista. Adios.